Greetings everyone, today we delve into the world of wealth building, a journey that shapes our lives significantly. Imagine a life where financial worries become a thing of the past, where the peace of mind that comes with financial well-being becomes your reality. This isn't a distant dream, but a tangible goal that can be achieved through small, consistent steps. From setting financial goals to exploring additional income streams, we have a lot to cover. Without further ado, let's dive into building a brighter financial future for you. Remember, a journey of a thousand miles begins with a single step. For our wealth building journey, that first step is setting financial goals. Now, these aren't just any random aspirations. These are tangible, realistic targets that will guide your financial decisions and actions. Think of your financial goals as the destination on your financial roadmap. Without them, you're simply driving without a sense of direction. Let's break down these goals into three categories, short term, medium term and long term. Short term goals could be anything from saving for a vacation to paying off a small debt. Medium term goals might include buying a car or saving for a down payment on a house. Long term goals? Think retirement savings or building a college fund for your children. Remember that story of the tortoise and the hare? Slow and steady wins the race. Similarly, setting and sticking to your financial goals, no matter how small, can lead you to the finish line of financial freedom. Goals are the stepping stones to your dreams, so set them wisely. Next, we tackle the backbone of financial success, budgeting. Budgeting is like a roadmap for your finances. It guides you from where you are to where you want to go. It's about understanding your income and how you're spending it. It's about making sure you're not spending more than you're earning. And you know what? It's not as daunting as it sounds. Picture a toolbox. Now imagine that toolbox is filled with budgeting tools. These could be as simple as a spreadsheet or a budgeting app on your phone. These tools help you track your income and expenses, making it easier to see where your money is going and identify areas where you could save. Creating a budget's one thing, sticking to it is another. Be realistic with your budget and don't be too harsh on yourself. Remember, it's okay to have fun money as long as it's within your means. Essentially, a budget is telling your money where to go instead of wondering where it went. Now, uh, let's talk about our financial safety net, the emergency fund. Imagine this, you're walking a tightrope. Below you is a safety net, that's what an emergency fund is, a financial safety net there to catch you when life throws unexpected expenses your way. It's not a matter of if life will throw you a curveball, but when. It could be a car repair, a medical expense, or even a sudden job loss. Having an emergency fund can mean the difference between a minor hiccup and a financial catastrophe. So, how do you build this fund? Start small. Aim to save three to six months of living expenses. You can set aside a fixed amount from each paycheck or automate your savings. The key is consistency. Remember, this is not a get-rich-quick scheme or an investment. It's insurance for life's unexpected moments. An emergency fund is not the most exciting thing, but it certainly is one of the most important. Debt can be a heavy burden, but there are ways to lighten the load. Debt, if not managed properly, can be a roadblock on your path to financial freedom. It's like carrying a backpack filled with stones while trying to climb a mountain. The heavier the bag, the harder the climb. The first step is to understand the nature of your debt. Is it high interest credit card debt, student loans, a mortgage? Once you've taken inventory, prioritize repayment based on the interest rates. Generally, it's best to pay off high interest debt first. Next, consider strategies like debt consolidation or refinancing to reduce interest rates. Alternatively, the snowball method, where you focus on paying off the smallest debt first to gain momentum, can be psychologically rewarding. Let's draw inspiration from those who've walked this path before. There are countless success stories of individuals who've paid off significant debts, turning their financial lives around. It's a journey, and every small step counts. Being in control of your debt is being in control of your freedom. Investing might seem complex, but it doesn't have to be. Think of it as a game of chess where strategic moves can help you win. The essence of investing is buying assets that you believe will increase in value over time. It's a key component in wealth building, acting as a vehicle that propels your money into more money. Now, you don't need to be a Wall Street whiz to start. Simple investment options suitable for beginners include index funds and ETFs. These allow you to invest in a wide range of companies, spreading out your risk. But here's the secret source, the power of compounding. This is when your earnings generate even more earnings. You receive interest not only on your original investments, 
but also on any interest, dividends and capital gains that accumulate. So your money grows faster over time and the longer you leave it invested, the more opportunity it has to grow. Remember, investing is a marathon, not a sprint. Investing is the process of making money work for you instead of you working for it. Diversifying income, the secret source to financial success. Now, when we talk about diversifying income, we're talking about creating multiple streams of income. This could be your regular nine to five job, a side hustle, freelancing, or even income from investments. It's like having several pots on the stove each simmering away to make your financial stew richer and more robust. Now, you might be wondering how to create these additional income streams. Well, it could be as simple as leveraging a hobby you're passionate about and turning it into a small business, or perhaps using your professional skills to freelance on the side. Even making smart investments can become a significant income source over time. The beauty of diverse income streams is that they not only boost your overall income, but also provide a safety net. If one source takes a hit, you have others to fall back on. So remember, don't put all your eggs in one basket. Diversify. We've covered a lot today, but remember, every journey starts with a single step. We've talked about setting financial goals, budgeting, emergency funds, managing debt, investing and diversifying income streams. Now, it's time to take that first step towards your bright financial future. You can find plenty of resources for further learning in the description box below. So, don't wait. Start your wealth building journey today. Share your thoughts, goals or success stories in the comments below. We're all in this journey together. Thank you for joining us on this journey today. We're grateful for your time and hope you found value in our financial insights. Stay tuned for our upcoming deep dive into investing. Until next time, remember the secret to wealth is simple. Spend less than you earn and invest the rest wisely. If you enjoy this type of content, do acknowledge it with a thumbs up. Subscribe and stay connected with our community for more content. Until next time, take care.